Hi, my name is Weta Brown, and today I want to talk a little bit about cold weather running. The idea came about following a few discussions on Facebook. I posted a link to an article in Runner's World speaking about motivation to run this time of year. My goal was to recruit some people to run with me. I always love company. I run year-round. Rain, sleet, snow. Usually if it's below zero or several inches of snow on the ground or ice, I'll take it to the dead mill. Other than that, I'm outside. Running means a lot to me. I've been running long distance since 2010. Running helped me through a major depression following the death of my mother. I even wrote a book about it. Running is cheaper than therapy, a journey back to wholeness. So I just want to share with you some things that I use to help me stay warm this time of year. Today I'm about to go run. I have on a light beanie, fly eagles fly. I have on some ear warmers. My ears get cold. I have on a light jacket. I also have on a singlet. It's about 47 degrees, wind chill 45, usually in the 40s. I'll get hot in 10 to 15 minutes and I'll take off my jacket. But on the way back, it may be a little bit windier, so I'll put it back on. If I'm racing, I'll put on sleeves versus wearing a jacket. I also have on shorts. You can't see my legs. I also will wear um, light gloves because my hands do get cold. Between 30s and 40s, I'll put on pants. I'll also have a long sleeve shirt, usually no jacket, unless it's low 30s. I'll put on a beanie that's a little thicker, low 30s and below, still representing my eagles. I have several, I call them gators. Um, this is a neck one. I'll put on in the 30s and below. I can pull it up and pull it down. I also have some lighter gators. This one covers my, um, my head. This one as well. I also have thicker ones for 30 and below. I have different colors of this one. It's a little bit more warm and it's thicker. When it gets colder in the 30s and below, I wear mittens. I like these mittens. They're also cycling mittens, but they're warm. So I use them for cycling as well as um, running. I also wear wool, wool socks. for 30s and below. 20s and below, I'll put in hot hands. Or sometimes in the 30s, I'll put them in my pocket because sometimes it drops when I'm out or um, it'll be windy on the way back. I usually run a lake front. It's an out and back run. And sometimes the wind catches me one way so it's colder. If it's in the single digits, I'll wear um, a ski mask. It scared a few people, but it's really warm. I don't put it on if it's 20s or above because my face actually overheats. When it gets down to 20s, teens, single digits, I'll wear this jacket with my long sleeve shirt. This is thin, but it's warm. And I also I'll wear this uh, fleece jacket, which is really warm, over it. And sometimes, as I mentioned before, it's warmer in one direction versus the other. So this way I can take it off and put around my waist. Basically, the key to running in the cold is layering. And also, after you run enough, you kind of know 
what's good for you. I run hot. So when I'm running and I see people that usually have on more clothes than me, you have to figure out what's good for you. That's why I like the guide, the runner's world guide, because whether you run hot or cold, whether it's windy where you are, it can kind of give you a guide on what to wear. When it's raining, I have a um, thin jacket, but it's waterproof. And also I wear a visor or um, usually a, a hat when it's, it's warmer. I mean, when it's, yeah, when it's cool, excuse me. I have a thicker waterproof jacket. It happens good. And I still wear a, some type of hat, something with a bib to keep water on my face. If it's snowing, I'll sometimes wear my ski goggles that way I keep snow out of my face if it's snowing a lot. So these are just a few items that I use to keep me running all year long. Thanks for listening. If you have any questions about the gear I use and my way to get it, um, you can post a comment underneath the video. Thanks for listening.